Mar Damon. She split on you. I don't know what she did to you, but you know what? I'm done trying to figure it out, pal. Carla. Must find metal detector. So that's a giant litter box down there. I don't know if you Things can tell. Things do look bad, but this jump wouldn't do the trick, unfortunately. Should try to make up you with her. You wouldn't have a second metal detector around here, would you? Ugh. You wouldn't Rude. happen to have a second metal detector around here, would you? Ugh. I wonder if I could like try to give her a drink now. Maybe try to woo her. Come on, baby. Oh, have a little respect. Oh, now she doesn't want it. Now she's like, "Fuck you, dick." Jeez. Why must you use everyone for metal detectors, Manny? Bye, Carla. Drop dead. She'll come around. So this is where the cat track is, I believe. There's uh, a couple different hey, entrances around here. Oh, something going on? I don't remember this. I guess there's a race going Looks on. Looks like a great night for cat races. Things do look bad, <laughs> but this jump wouldn't do the trick, unfortunately. Looks like a great night for cat races. I guess you can't actually look down there. Um, but this actually... Oh, oh, sorry, monsieur, but this is the elevator to the High Rollers Lounge. That's where I'm going. It is members only. You must be new. And you must have a VIP pass to come upstairs. Adieu. Oh wow, I don't remember not Tuesday, being <laughs> being able to get in there. So, uh, I guess we should go to Charlie. Because he likely will have something for me. I thought there was an easier way to get down here, but I, I think there is. I just forgot what it was. But I don't mind, uh... I don't mind passing this again. I think it's really cool. I know that statue's supposed to mean something about justice, but I don't know. Let's go back to, um... Oh, let's take our little handy elevator that I never tire of. Let's go back to the blue casket. And see if anything has changed. So far we haven't done anything except get Terry in trouble. <laughs> My bad. Go in here. Uh, Olivia, we are done talking to her. What's in my inventory? This will help me to remember what I need to do. Oh, I remember what we can do. I'm gonna put this stuff away. I think we actually can get that metal detector. I'm gonna do a little bit of backtracking here. There's so much to do uh, in this game that sometimes it's easy to forget what you actually need to do. Even when you're playing one of your favorite games, um, it's kind of easy to get a little lost or for, just in general forget what you need to do. That's just how adventure games work, I'm afraid. I'm gonna go back over here. I love that. I love that statue. I really like creepy statues. Post pictures of creepy statues below in the comments and I will look at them because I love creepy statues. Uh, my favorite is the demonic horse in, uh, in Denver, Colorado at the uh, Denver airport. You should look up demon horse and you will find it. I think there's actually another... We didn't actually go down here, and I meant to. There's one of the cats. They're huge. They don't have much use when they're alive, and stuff, they don't have much more. There's a plaque over here, I think. 
beloved Sandspoof, this regal and majestic feline was a record holder for speed and a favorite of the crowds here in Rubacaba for many years until her career was suddenly and tragically cut short on the second week of the racing season when the airship Olivia won on its maiden voyage crashed onto the track mid-race and exploded. Mm. Many bereaved fans testified later that before the blimp hit, Sandspoof was in the lead. Sad. So they had it stuffed and preserved. So here's the Fucci. gigantic... That smell is peor que la muerte. Gigantic kitty litter, because these well, cats are huge. That's the hole I saw Carlos' metal detector fall through. Oh no. What is this here? There we go. It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for kitty. Never know when you're gonna need that. That is one nasty. Nasty kitty litter as it is, tub. I just can't bring myself to jump in the giant unclean kitty litter. Fortunately, we're looking for a metal detector. So, there, do you hear it? Our scythe is actually metal. So let's see. I think it gets louder. Okay, now it's getting softer, so it's got to be over here somewhere. Try over here. Uh -huh. There we go. Boom! I was born to do this. A little stinky, but it could be worse. All right. All right, now that we have got our metal detector back, I forgot what to do. It's been a while since I've played this game, so you're gonna have to bear with me on some of the things because even some of my favorite games, even if I play them over and over again, sometimes I forget what to do. But I do remember that we need to get into this VIP area, so first things first, I'm gonna go to, uh, I'm gonna go talk to Charlie, our little, our little casino rat friend. Ah, oh, so beautiful. So beautiful. Have you ever seen a Zeppelin that looked more beautiful than that? I don't think so. I always really wanted to go into the Zeppelin though. I thought that'd be really, really awesome. Okay. Oh, another thing um, that we haven't done yet, I don't think, is talk to uh, this guy in here. He is the Late night at mortician, the morgue, isn't it, Membrio? You know I can't sleep with John Doe's on the slab, Manny. If I don't ID these rose gardens tonight, I won't be ready for the two that come in tomorrow. And before you, what a job! It, I'm up to my ass in his areas. He said a bad word. Okay, let's go talk to him. I like Membrio. He's such a weird. He's using a fork to go through these guys. Digging through flower beds is Membrio's job, not mine. Digging through flower beds is Membrio's job, not mine. Talk to Membrio. Stop looking at the what things. There story. we go. These two sprouted and no one came down to claim them? Death makes sad stories of us all. That's nice. How absolutely depressing. Can I help? Can I help? Sure. Grab hold of this leaf right Ugh, here. On second thought. <laughs> Manny's like, uh... Manny? I can't do it. I know. I was just testing. <laughs> That's funny. How's business? Booming, unfortunately. More crime every day. And more and more sproutings like these. Something's happening back in Elmaro, I think. And its dark hand is finally reaching us here in Rubacava. Let's see. What are you? What exactly for? are you looking for? I'm digging for a treasure that part of me does not wish to find. 
For when I uncover that sad doubloon that tells me who this poor soul is, my reward is not riches, but the chance to make a phone call and break somebody's heart. Of course, with this equipment, the search could go on for some time. That is not equipment, that is a fork. Like seriously, who gives you a fork? Well, don't let me bother you. I don't think that's a very good nice thing to, have visitors. to search the dead with. So, I am going to generously give him my metal detector. Would a metal detector help the cause? Hey, look at me. Look at me when I'm talking to you, Membrio. There we go. Hey, <laughs> just like downtown. Trade you for the fork. You never know what this will turn up. An engraved ring. Hint. A belt buckle with somebody's name on it. <laughs> Who would wear a belt buckle with the... <laughs> oh. Really? Really? Manny? You're wearing a belt buckle with your name on it? Well, I hope that helps you out, but I gotta go. We'll check back with him later. Now, let's see. I... Do I want to go up the awesome hut elevator thingy yet? Do I want to do that? Let's go up here. I gotta get back to, um... Yeah, I gotta get back to here. The casino. And up here. Okay, let's see. I wonder how Lupe is doing. Wait, no. Am I going the wrong way? <laughs> Why? Why must I constantly get lost? It's over here. We'll talk to Gladys in a few as well, but I'm gonna go in here and talk to Charlie. Ooh, I see, um, there's that cop who arrested Terry, our CB friend. Manny? Let's see, what else can you counterfeit? Can you make reasonable can you make union reasonable cards? Reasonable union cards? Manny! <laughs> are you going to start Manny? moonlighting? Or are you just looking to hang out with the sailors? Can you do it or not? Hmm. <laughs> Sassy. I have a deal for you. If you can retrieve my money from Maximino, I can make you president of that crooked union. What the hell? I don't need to be president. What kind of connections does he have? Money? I put a whole suitcase of it up for collateral on a rather large wager last month. The race was fixed, Manny. They stole my money like common thieves. Here, take this Here we go. Jackpot. and use it to get into the High Rollers Lounge. They won't let me in there anymore. Thank you, I there won't abuse it. Of course Somewhere not. in the wine cellar, and my suitcase should be in it. And you can get me a card tonight. If you make it back, Manny... The card will be on the table. You are way too trusting, my friend. All right. He doesn't even want to talk. There's not even any more dialogue trees. It's like, yep, got what I need. Look at Manny check out uh, the police officer's you know, butt. Some people say you should always walk away from the table when you're on a winning streak. Oh, yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Oh, man. Let's mess with him. Lidger, Blair, Barry Monk. Eventually, we're going to have to mess with him. I don't know if we're going to do that now, but... Actually, you know what? Gladys looks a little bit bored. Maybe we can help him out. Check out this fancy pass to the High Rollers Lounge. Can you believe how full of themselves they are over there? <laughs> I don't think their place is any more VIP than ours, do you? I don't know. I, I try to stay away from that place. Really? Why? Because of my... my... my problem. <laughs> problem is a proper Gosh. noun there, because it is a huge Nobody? problem. But now that he stopped hogging the piano... Ooh. Beautiful. Ooh. Beautiful, beautiful. Ooh, yeah! <laughs> yeah, one person. Thank you, thank you. 
That's what happens when you have no customers. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> there we go. That's what I wanted to do. What the hell? Why can't I get back there? I'm trying to dodge through these tables. Come on, Manny. You can do it. You own this place. You can get through the tables. Stop. Stop. There we go. No. What? No. Why did you do that? Why would you do that? Can I do that from anywhere? I guess not. Decided to have a bit of fun and just slide down Manny! like an inch of. Oh god, what? I have a note for you from Lola. Oh. Lola. Oh. Yes. Now la, where is it? La, 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 Lola. Oh, here. No. Wait. Dang. I have a note. whole new system for messages. Just let me. Here. No. No. Wait. Ah. <sighs> Be quiet. Here it is. Be quiet. Wait a second. It's empty. There was something inside. It felt like a key. A key? Yes! But did somebody come back here and snake the key while I was sorting the coats? Who would do that? They messed up my whole system! Did she actually give that to me? Let's see what it is. Oh, there's my giant, giant can opener. My liqueur. Uh, did she actually give me anything or not? I guess not put that away evening lupe hi manny okay back to work okay then okay <laughs> hi all right bye just kidding let's see can we still tr fall into the trench or did manny learn his lesson Oh man, somebody got smart and put a railing out there. Lola, Lola, where are you? Okay. We should probably check on Gladys because he sounded a little bit too eager to get to the VIP room. Something tells me not good things are happening with Gladys right now. Hey, buddy! Hi, how you doing? What you drinking there? Look like you're having fun. Oh, my God! Gambling so much, Gladys. Well, the doctors made me promise I wouldn't do it anymore. Oh. But they can't get in the high rollers, loud No, they they can't, buddy. They can't.